Throw that under there, sorry. All right. What's up, guys? Morning. <laughs> Putting it into our sizzle here, coming at you. We're in beautiful Stewart today. Very windy west wind, so we decided not to go offshore. Also got some storms coming. Right. And uh, Darcy caught a tiny little snook this morning. The sun just came up enough so I could film. And uh, we're hoping to catch a great fish today. <laughs> 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 I'm not exactly sure what. We're into our fishing in Stewart. We're gonna go north, try yeah. some new areas. Exactly. We got some pilchards in the boat already. We bought from the Stewart bait guy. Yep. So uh, it's gonna be pretty exciting. We gotta do this. Bring you another epic episode. We wanna catch a slot snook, maybe, or something else that Puddin can eat. You know, that's what I like. Heck yeah. Darcy just throwing us a beaky. There's been uh, red fins on the beach here in Stewart, if you guys are looking for, for bait here in Southeast Florida. Which is t the time of the year the bait usually starts to show up, so it's a good sign. Yeah, it's really great. So there's plenty of bait, and we'll probably buy some shrimp, and we gotta get fishing. You ready, Sizzle? Let's go. All right, let's go. We gotta go find the bait. Let's go. Oh my God. I just saw a big ass snook. But he's got it. He's got it. He's got it. Oh my gosh, eat it. There's snook going crazy over here. Little snook's got it now. I saw a big snook chase it. All right, let's get this guy released immediately. <laughs> this another little snooky for me this morning. Bending rods, having some fun. We're kind of out of the wind right now. Dude, it has like been blowing in Florida lately. I don't, just don't get it. I mean, we are in a transitional month now too, so the winds should start dying down here real soon because we're coming into our summertime, springtime months here. But we're just so tired of this wind, so we're kind of out of it. Whoa, buddy. Let's let him go, because I just saw a big one chase my bait. I just did a Brian release. <laughs> <laughs> you mean awesome? I mean awesome. Yes, somebody commented about your funny release too. <laughs> of course. I was just reeling him up and he came up and smashed it. No. Get out from there. Get out from there. No. Come here. That was cool. Watching him come up and eat that is sick. The bait's still on there. All right, buddy. Oh, God. He just head slammed the freaking trolling motor. Nice. Nice chunky guy right there. That was cool though, watching him come up and eat my bait. I was just reeling him up from underneath the dock there. And I just watched him swipe it, eat it, and then fought me, put up a good fight. Getting a little bigger here for us. Definitely not gonna be something I can keep. So we're just gonna let him go right away because we wanna get right back onto the fishing game and get some more fish in the boat. Snook number three, right? Yes, let's let him go. Thanks for the fun fight. No, get out of there. No, oh, I don't know what it is. Oh, you feisty Snooky. All right, we got a snook though. <laughs> I'm happy. It's been hours since you last saw me y'all because we've been struggling that much today. We have, like Brian has said earlier, we've got a cold front coming through, just really tough conditions. I say that a lot, but I'm really excited for springtime and summer. Come here Snook, come here Snook. And we just got another snook in the boat on the live pilchard. Just do this. Come here. Nice. Okay, so we've been looking for live bait. We've been fishing different areas, but not a whole lot of luck today. And we have a lot of water moving. We looked at the Fish Angler app, and today is supposed to be a good fishing day, but I don't know what's up with it. But So we're trying our hardest, and again, we've been out here for hours. We're not giving up. We're looking for snook today. That is the goal. Another gorgeous St. Lucie River Inlets, St. Lucie River Snook. I just need to get some guys a little bigger than this. So maybe I need, you, you can do a fish dance for me, Brian, or something. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Ah. All right, let's let him go immediately. Brian did a fish dance in that last deep sea fishing video we did, and it worked actually. I like hooked up to a fish when he was doing his floss dance. Uh, so we'll see what happens. Maybe he'll do that for us again. Let go of my thumb, please. Okay. Let's catch some more snook. Please just do a prayer for me right now and see how you get a little bit of a bigger one. <laughs> I need your guys' help today. Oh. Fish on. 
Gosh, dang it. Woo! That was nuts. Got him out though. Got him out of the dock. That's what counts. Back to back snook. That was sick. Oh my gosh. So sick. Fish is very frisky. Got him out in two seconds. Come on, buddy. Don't fight me under the boat. Come on. Nice one. Look at that guy. He's like golden. He is not ready. Okay, 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 okay. All right, so fish are starting to chew this afternoon. Nice. But he's literally the cousin. Oh, my fish hook bracelet. My lucky fish bracelet just got stuck. There we go. Nice. Look at that circle hook right in the corner, doing its job. Fish is free. He's literally the cousin, the twin of that other guy. It's same size. Chunky though. Nice fish. All right, I'm gonna get him right back in because I am stoked. We just keep moving up this dock and catching more and more fish. Whatever you guys are saying is working. Let's do it. Jeez. <laughs> I poked myself with a hook really bad the other day. And you know, like those little finger pokes, they hurt the worst out of anything. I got a big line cut right here. Hurts so bad. Just complaining about baby cuts. That's wimpy. I've got no fish on this thing yet. You haven't? Not one. That one we have. What? That next one we have. No, me, the f***ing lure. Oh. This one we caught a bunch here, just a, the, the one the first day, I think. I may have to do the fish dance. <laughs> the slot dance. Yes. Don't make me do the slot dance. Keeper dance. The twerk. And we all twerk. How's this? Is this how you do it? Are you going to moon them? <laughs> well, so there's a fish dance, but there's two dudes sitting right over here in this dock, and I'm going to look like a fool. Even more than when I'm cooking. <laughs> <laughs> Even more than when you're cooking? Even more than when I'm cooking. That's a lot. When I'm cooking, it's a lot like burning. Burning and making a mess. I got to I gotta tell you guys. I got to tell you guys a secret. Don't tell them. I'm making a mess. Oh, she makes a big mess in the kitchen. I make a big mess of that pain you guys got me. And I got to tell you, I, I, I kind of use a little movie magic on the triple tails. What does that mean? <laughs> Remember I burned them and then I had to put them in the oven and then I took them out of the oven and I pretended I cooked them on the frying pan? <laughs> or was that some other fish? I think it was a triple tail. It was so thick. It was. So I basically browned it and then put it in the oven like you would a steak. But it was... <laughs> <laughs> but I burned the hell out of one side pretty good. But it tasted fine, but it, it looked like crap. So there's a little, we're doing so poorly today on the target species. Yes. That I'm giving you a little inform inside information. There you go. In the next the, fish we catch, we'll talk about why I wear, what I wear. In the next, if we catch a big fish, I'm gonna have to delete this whole part. <laughs> delete it. Delete Sorry. it. Let me get out of the way so you guys pay attention. All right, we gotta, we, where else we gotta go here? Oh, fish on. It's a jet. No, it's a snook. Oh, no, I don't know. Get him, Sizzle. Ah, <sighs> got you. I got you. Let's get the net. Woo, sick. These are some frisky, chump, jarp, chump, blah, blah, blah. Charp and jump and snook. <laughs> He's nice. He's a nice one. He ain't done. He's doing a circle. Under the boat. Get the rod tip down. You don't want that line touching anything. It'll break off in two seconds from that abrasion. Come on, buddy. We're going to land you now. Come on. Oh, it's a beautiful fish. Ready? I'm kind of not, oh, not ready. He's not ready. Get ready. Nice fish. Oh, it's heavier. Baby. Nice fish, baby. <gasps> nice fish. He's not baby. it. I'm not gonna get excited. It's 26. Stop. Oh. It's a nice fish, though. Yeah. That's a beautiful fish. Mm -hmm. So as this day is progressing, now I've got bigger and bigger fish. So again, we have this front really approaching within the next couple hours, and it will turn on a bite, and that is proving true today. Um, usually that will occur. Gotta chill out. 
Circle hook right in the corner, perfect. And pop it right out. And the Smith pliers? Got it. There we go. So usually when a front approaches, usually it turns on the bite because the fish know the temperature, the baronic temperature is rising or lowering, whatever is happening. And usually that gets them chewing before we have a cold front come through or some type of front. So that is a beautiful fish. Nice. I don't think he's going to be on my S word, but let's just get a quick measure anyhow. 27 inch fish, guys. Oh. One more inch. Well, he's not straight. There he goes. Yeah, he's just at 27. Goodness gracious. <sighs> well, at least I got to finish. I'm, I'm running out of bait quickly here. So I got at least I got to finish using a half dead bait. He ate it. <laughs> That's what counts. Beautiful. Beautiful. They fight so much harder than those smaller ones. He's holding you mean on. the bigger ones fight harder than the smaller He's ones? He's sucking on my thumb. He doesn't want to leave. Well, yeah, I'm just saying, like, even that five inch difference or whatever, like, he put up that much more of a fight. He's strong, powerful fish. You let him go. He's a, yeah, pull I your see. tongue. Pull, we gotta go fishing. Look. Pull it out. <laughs> You're free. Give him a pet. He likes you. That was cool. Nervous. Getting eight, eight, another nice fish. Jeez, crushing it. 26 in the boat, back to back snook at the same dock B. Brian didn't even do the fish dance yet. How about you just do the fish dance for me? We'll catch a nice one. Pretty, ate another almost dead bait. Another nice fish. Very pretty. He's nice and clean. Look at that. Yeah, he's super pretty. Took a look right in the corner. There we go. Relax. There we go. Pretty guy. It's probably going to be 26 and a half is my guess. Yeah, it's fun. We're going to let him go. We're getting big fish though. Nice one. He's really pretty. All right. Very ready, very cool. This cold front definitely has got the snook fired up. So we just gotta go find a big boy still. The quest is not over. Let's go, snook, let's go. Hooked up. I think it's a jack. No, it's a snook. <sighs> Backwards. <laughs> nice. That's a nice fish, actually. Ooh. Woo! Chill out, buddy. Chill out. That's a nice fish, actually. When they're down deep, they look so much smaller. So as this day is progressing, the bigger ones are starting to chew. Buddy, chill. Chill. Oh, tearing up my thumb. Oh, that hurt. Please chill. Look at my thumbs bleeding. <laughs> oh. That's a nice one, too. Big fish sitting back there. Please chill out. Oh, my fingers are killing me. Worth it though. Worth it to catch these beautiful fish. Sorry about the helicopter noise. I'll put him on the reservoir, but I'm sure he's exactly the same like our friend, other friends. Yeah. Buddy, chill. Oh yeah, yeah. Easy, 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 easy. He's easy, very easy. alive. It's very. Alive. Let him go. Oh, see, I told you. Snook thumb. Got me good, buddy. Wow. See the thumb. When you get them in two seconds like that, you know. Oh, look at the thumb. Yeah. He was tearing me up when he, when Hold he saw steady. He, he was tearing me up when he saw him shaking like that. He was biting down, clamping on my thumb, and going like this as hard as he could. Ow. All right, catch me another one. All right, Dar Sizzle. You have two more baits left. <laughs> yes. You gotta do the fish dance. Ready? Ready, let's go. <laughs> Do the floss, do the floss. Catch me a fish. The floss. Let's go, fish. Oh, oh. This one. Oh, he just shook it off. It was definitely not the fish that ate it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We are just snook slaying machines today, dudes. Straight slaying. Just can't get myself a bigger one than 27. 
I am cursed. This is the Dark Sizzle curse. It's official. I know 25s, 26s, and 27s so well now. This is definitely a 25. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even measuring it. Let's let them go. Let's see if I can make something happen with an artificial bait or a live shrimp. We'll see what happens, but I got no more live fish or live pilchards, which is such a bummer. Mullet clip right over here. I can't see like a school. Oh, that's mine. Get him out. Get him out, Brian. Oh. Jeez, that was a huge fish. Oh. On the terror eyes. Right? Yeah. He was way back there. Couldn't stop him. That was a huge hole in the water. Wow, dude. Get out of there. I just pulled his butt out of there. If it was a big fish, he's not. If it was a big fish, I would have been sick though. <laughs> All right. We literally, there's a storm coming. I can see it coming. These fish are still chewing and I've got no more lug bait and artificials are working. All right, so we literally have a thunderstorm approaching with this front that we keep talking about. It's been approaching all day, and because I have no more live bait, we're like, let's throw our DOAs, and Brian literally just threw a dar sizzle fit. That's what I do when I lose a big fish, <laughs> but we lost a monster. Brian lost a monster. So I tied on the same exact thing that he was using. Let's let this bad boy go. He's fine. Brian release, because he gets credit for this. But so we, we just switched it up and I just put on a DOA Terrorize in, I think it's like a root beer color. Same as that color Brian's throwing and just caught a snook. All right, everybody, it's all the rains, we gotta come in. As well as you all know, the Darcy stinks of fishing. She couldn't catch us a slot fish all season so far. What's up? <laughs> Wrap up the video. Cool. You know, I don't, I'm not sure this is going to be a video because we were hoping to catch a slot snook to make a catch. Uh, but we had such a great time, caught so many fish, we should make it a video. What do you think? We did have a great time. Yeah. So it happened in the afternoon. We Brian was just telling me yesterday about how fishing in the afternoon is wasteless. And today we wasteless. killed it. Wasteless? I'm wasteless. It. <laughs> <laughs> it's wasteful time. It's wasteful. That was, that was wasting funny. your time on the water in the afternoon. But no, not today. Uh, killed it. No, we didn't. We didn't get a slot. You goofball. We could have went home at noon. It. And still did not have a you slot. You lost my slot. I did lose a slot. Me. So the, uh, my, uh, the one that I had a crybaby for yeah. on, maybe this video will be mm. putting as a crybaby fit. But uh, the fish just got wrapped around. It was too big. I tried to even thumb this pool to stop it. It got wrapped around some oyster poles, poles with oysters on them. Yeah. And then my braid broke. Wasn't it my hook, my leader? I not in the, the brain. He basically wasn't using the proper setup for fishing under structure like no, that. No, I was tackling down all day because I get one bite on a darn yeah, lure. So. And then I was using my bass rod. Yeah. You either lose the fish in the first few seconds or you're not going to lose them at all. And Brian couldn't stop the fish. Yeah, so. Yeah. Whatever. It is what it anyway, is. Anyway, another great day with my beautiful girlfriend. Yes. Give me a kiss. It's going to happen though. We only got, we've Rush. only got like five more weeks before season closes. We gotta get this done. We gotta bring you a snook catch clean cook. All right guys, so last until time, next time. Last time we did that was when my dad was alive. Oh, so stop. we gotta so do sad. it, we gotta do it. All right, you gotta do it for Tim. Yes. The dance didn't work. Come Come on, dad, by the way, me, my dance, bring my me a dance slot. days might be over. Bring me a slot, all right. All right, until next time. Follow your dream and keep on catching. And wash your hands. <laughs> <laughs>